my brakes are wearing down. In the front, anyway. Yeah, I had them real loose anyway because I didn't want to grab them. I just wanted to slow me down. Well, back in 1958, when my parents out here scouting out a house up here on this hill, this stone wall and this stone wall were connected, and there was nothing on this side except trees and grass and field, uh, yeah, and they came looking at two homes, uh, from what I understand, but they looked at this blue one over here, yes, it had that attachment on the side, I think. I don't positively know if it might have been a garage or, I don't know, or this one. <coughs> and I guess they chose to have one built. My dad said the cost for the house back in 1958 was 18000 24 by 48 ranch for the basement. Three bedroom. Small three bedroom. Sure. What a deal. So, after he, uh, wanted him and my mom wanted to go to Florida, uh, I bought the house from him. Because just exactly the same time the housing market went nuts and I got quadruple bob duples what I owed on the house I bought the house for 27,000 I owed 12 and I got paid a hundred and four thousand for it and the guy got rid of it the next year because he got stationed somewhere else And uh, I had 85 grand in my hand, and my dad says, I'll sell you the house for 90. I said, Here you go, Dad. All right, kids, have a good time in Fla. Enjoy your what? You're living on the third fairway? <laughs> Little golf club down there, I guess. Park themselves on the third fairway. Walk out of the sliding glass door onto the third fairway. Look at me, I'm in the same place I would be too. Enjoying every bit of life I can by uh, right through my neighborhood. Yeah. Just right through my neighborhood. Notice I stopped at that stop sign, so just make sure I got that on video. So, good day. Some, uh, I rolled and smoked some of my good, my new stuff. Uh, I, I, the new stuffs I just purchased, I, uh, hits off of that and uh, a vodka on the rocks. Thank you very much. I must be an easy date because uh, that's real cheap. <laughs> really. Not even a half a joint and a five dollar vodka. Oh wait a minute. No, four and a quarter. Yeah, she gave me four. four. No, five and a quarter. That's right. All right, whatever. <laughs> I don't care. I gave her the four buck. I got a chip from somebody else who purchased them today. I was gone as soon as I got my my drink. Well, as soon as I ordered my drink, I should have said that, but 
I had a fetty. I had a fetty on me. You know, you can do a lot of the bar with a fetty. So I didn't spend that fetty today. But I did spend my nine dollars in singles that I had. <laughs> uh, yeah, I got a I got a free drink out of it. Some guy at the end of the bar bought for the bar, and uh, the fuck am I gonna go with it? As long as I get that fucking stipend from Uncle Stam, these guy seems to be all set. And when that stops, everybody ain't getting nothing either. I'm guaranteed. Because I'm at the low bottom head of this frickin' list, Palaronis. Yeah, like I said, a stipend. So anyway, I... Doing all right. Doing okay, like I told the people at the bar today, I said, I don't see it except on TV. I live in a small rural town. I watch TV and I watch YouTube. I see it on there. Evidently, they they got their head up their ass. Really? Why would we want to go start something with Russia? Frickin' idiots. I don't care under any circumstances. For Christ's sakes, think about it, you idiots. I know, you have your old world coming in. It's a new world, so. I won't be here when a new world is in order. Nah, I don't think so. Could happen tomorrow. But I, like I said, <laughs> news travels real slow getting up here except online. Other than that. That's what I see online or on the, on the TV. Five five is ten. <laughs> five five is uh, eleven. Yeah, this is just over eleven. Yeah, same thing. All right. I'm his home. Ooh, let's go down and inspect the end of the street here where these guys from the town fixed up what the uh, plow did this winter at the end of the street. Oh, I'm going to put up some freaking steel, steel girders when this woman comes down. Go squirrel, go. Oh, she chopped up all of these places. I had three, two, three uh, little spikes in the ground. They, you know, little reflectors, probably about a quarter inch wide. And three foot tall anyway. But she came down here and she took this corner out and this basketball net. She hit the basketball net and then pulled back and hit it again. And then pulled back in and pulled it with her in for about 10 or 12 foot. And they came down here the other day. And she must have beat this up. So they came down here and repaired all of this. This is at the end of the street. This is nothing but mud. Oh yeah, he repaired all of it. And they tossed it over here. Yeah, what they scraped off of that, they tossed over here. See it? I got two piles right there. Okay, that's the end of my street. You heard me. My street.
So anyway, the moral of the story is, out of those two homes that I showed you prior to where I'm is right now, they had somebody build that for them. Not the garage, just the ranch. What a stylish looking place. Oh, whoever lives there, man, has got class. I'm telling you right now. I don't want to live there. <laughs> what? I do? Get the hell out of town. I don't live here, do I? Uh-oh, no power. Come on. I don't have low anymore, and I'm getting tired. And my legs don't go up as high anymore either. You know what I'm saying? I sit a little bit higher, my legs don't have to come as high up, my knees I should say. Well, they do now because I lowered the seat. That was tough getting on and off the bike. Yeah, my nuts were dragging on the freaking seat as I went over to put my leg on the other side. What can I say? See if we can get through the night here. So far, so good. I think. Oh, no tools. I put them on afterwards. Home. I don't know where I was for a second there either. You know, I kind of lost it for a minute. I zoomed out. You know what the zoomed out means? <laughs> Tuned. Let's shut them off. Okay. Oh, water. Water, water, water. Who right time? Yes, sir, Bob Louis. I mean that one cannon, or even that red uh, uh, vato that I have. Very slippery. I would have to put one of those pop-ups on it, which I did on my cannon. The red ones need the same thing. They're Ten bucks a whack. And I don't use the cameras that much. Would I use the cameras that much if I changed the, put a pop-up on it? I kind of have to you know, tell myself to, uh, yeah, change it. Does that mean? Is that what I mean? I don't know. I don't care. Oh, lights on. I gotta fix that. It goes in some kind of a round socket. And I don't see what. What do we got here? <gasps> Quarter of six. Well, I guess we're gonna have not gonna get pork chops tonight. 
I mean, how the world are double hard people do this? Wow. That's got to be the hardest thing is to reach your feet. And when you're a new baby, that's the first thing you played with was just their feet. Well, if you're a guy, you should be playing with yourself is the first thing you do when you're a baby. Not play with your feet. <laughs> 